We exist to empower women with the freedom found in Jesus Christ. God has grown Him for Her Ministries to encompass five initiatives that impact all women everywhere. These initiatives are expanding His kingdom for generations to come. And once you've seen the miracles of God, how can you help but not share what He's doing throughout the world? I wish I could take you into prison with me just for a minute, imagine to see their faces, to look in their eyes, to hear their hearts cry. Mothers, sisters, daughters, they don't look any different than you and I. These women are the least of these that Jesus talks about in scripture. Who's gonna go? Who's gonna send them? Here am I, Lord, send me. Imagine with me as they walk into our events in prison and you just see them downcast. You see them depressed. It's not me, it's God's word. Melt their hearts in such a manner that they're crying. They're lifting their arms. They're receiving Jesus Christ in a whole new way. They begin to take Bible studies. They begin to worship. They begin to just discover who they are in Jesus Christ. They're thinking straight probably for the first time in a long time. And they realize what they've done. But now what? Now, don't get me wrong. I'm all about you do the crime, you do the time. Once they've satisfied the government's requirements, then what? Are we gonna be there to give them a second chance? Are we gonna walk alongside them? Who's going to give them a fresh start? Almost everyone gets released from prison. 95% of those incarcerated will be released to your own backyard. 75% of those will reoffend within three years. But if you mentor them, walk alongside them, train them, support them, show them a new way of life, only 8% of those that have been mentored will reoffend. It's a no-brainer. Just to be growing in God's faith, becoming spiritually fit, um, having you and your team guide me to do the right thing. When we go to meet with the mentees, uh, we are asking all sorts of questions that the organization has prepared for us to, to ask. So we're asking about housing, what sort of housing needs do they need? We're asking parenting, some have parenting needs once they get out. We're asking about where they wanna work, we, we're asking about their dreams, their hopes for the future, and uh, even just practical things like, do you need clothing? Our Him For Her housing program not only provides accountability to these women, but access to a home, a real home, that provides a safe environment for a fresh start. I would pray that prayer of Jabez, that God would expand my territory. Never did I even imagine that it would be through an invitation to do radio. Why Him For Her Radio, Women's Hot Topics? Our aim is to free women in Christ who struggle with the tough topics of today. Oh man, in an upside down world where right is wrong and wrong is right, we tell it like it is. So women can see these tough topics and challenges in their life through the lens of Jesus Christ. Will you join us? through Him For Her Ministries, as we partner together in these five initiatives of radio, speaking, prison ministry, prison mentoring, and housing. Let's team together through your prayers, through your experience, through your financial giving, and let's watch what God can do in the lives of these women as we set women free throughout the United States. It just doesn't get any better than this.